and how, how, how do you expect to respond? All I can do is just prepare my best for the game and give my best effort. What was kind of the mood around the team yesterday, or a couple days ago when he went down? Was it just kind of was yeah, it hard to just, see another injury? Yeah, you never want to see someone get hurt. So we're just devastated. And, you know, we have to bounce back from that. You know, we wish him the best. Uh, we, I pray for him with a um, speedy recovery and all that. I want him to get uh, healthy soon, but we have to bounce back and win this game for all the injured guys and everyone on the team. Does your mindset change at all now? You're obviously going to have a bigger role um, January 1st. Do you have to change your mindset at all? Um, I, I had the same mindset all season. Just prepare my best for the game. Practice, practice hard, practice, practice like I can be out there every play. I just give my best effort. That's all I can do. Coach Neal talked about how Efo sort of got you guys, uh, told you guys, you know, take care of yourselves. I can handle. I'm fine. Things will be fine. How, how important is that to hear from a guy who just went down? Um, it's good to hear he's in good spirits. It's good to hear he's in good spirits. And uh, you know, we're just trying to go out there and win the game for him. You know, I know he, he wished he could be out there, but we're gonna win the game for him. And, you know, play our best, give our best effort for him. Your, your mindset's the same, your preparation is the same, but the situation's different. How does that change or affect you? Um, I just have to step into a bigger role, a starting role. I have to hold my own and just show people that, you know, you just can't pick on me because I'm out there and I'm a new corner. Does that make you excited? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm excited. I'm, I'm excited for the game to show people what I can do and just, you know, give my best effort. Have you been in this Yeah, uh, I started the Wyoming game, and then um, when Ipo went down in the first quarter uh, Utah, I was in mostly the whole game, so I've been in this situation. How does that help, or how does that affect you getting ready for this one? Uh, it just gives me more experience. What kind of impact does all the extra time you have give you, given that you have a lot more time before the game than normal? I'm just studying the uh, Florida State offense and just knowing their tendencies and all that. You had a bad fourth quarter against UCLA. I said you learned a lot from that. How have you grown from that experience? Uh, just, just knowing what people would do in the red zone, knowing uh, back shoulder throws, and <clears throat> and just their tendencies, what quarterbacks will do in the red zone, and what teams will try and do in the defense. The valuable lessons for you that oh, pay yeah. off. <laughs> what do you see out of a player like James Winston? Uh, <clears throat> he's a playmaker. He can, he can extend the play, and um, he's always looking for the open receiver. And uh, he makes good decisions, and he's just overall good, a good quarterback. Assuming Florida State takes a couple shots at you early, you know, you, you have to assume they're going to look at picking on you a little bit and yeah. see what you can do. Do you take that personally? Do you take it as motivation? No, I, ta I take it as motivation. Just I just want to show them what I can do. That's really it. You know, they, they don't know me. They're going to pick on me because I'm a new corner, so I just have to show them what I can do. Ifo's obviously a senior, he's going to be gone. This essentially sort of starts the Chris Cisse era, right? Uh, I guess you could say that <laughs> next year. It's going to be, we're going to be a young group, so it's going to be a new a new era for the DBs. Chris, what have you learned from Ifo that you'll take with you going forward? What, I, can you say what that have you learned from Ifo this year that you'll kind of take with you going forward? Everything. Just preparation, hard work, um, everything you could bring to the table. You, you talk, a whole group. I learned a lot.